Hey guys, Brock Bowman here with uh, something different today. I I don't think I've told you guys, but I like old stereo equipment, vintage stuff. Um, and today we happen to have a TC-377 by Sony. It's a reel-to-reel. Um, and it was acting very sluggish. It already had the belts done and just really wasn't turning well. Like you could hear the motor and everything else was seemed to be working. There's no fuses out, but I finally decided to take it apart and see what was up. And after reading some forums, I figured out that it was more than likely the start capacitor, run capacitor, um, similar to like AC systems, refrigerators, uh, just about anything with an AC motor nowadays. But um, on these, they're kind of a funny one because this is uh, back from, I think 71 was the release date of this. It might have been 73, it's one of those two. Anyway, and on this one, it's the round style. Now you can find these, but they get to be kind of expensive and they're often hard to find in this low of a size, these small. Um, by the way, if you are having any kind of problems like this where it's running sluggish, one way to check this is you can usually look at the top of this thing. As you can see, I've already started taking this apart, but you can look at the top of this thing and usually they'll be bulged at the top. That's just kind of the indicator. It gets expanded in there. There's some cardboard and weird mixture of paste and god knows what else in there um, but as it starts to fail they expand and it pops the top out like that so it's kind of a dead giveaway you can there's also ways to do it with a voltmeter ohm meter whatever but um, honestly if it's running slowly and having issues but everything else seems fine it's probably this now what you're going to find out there in plenty is these newer style run capacitors okay i already got this one i got it prepped to go um but i mean they work just fine i've already tested this it fixed all the problems having to do with the running reversing for fast forward all that stuff um but i just want to make a quick video because i've had, found it hard to find any videos on this stuff so if this is your bag man you know it's groovy <laughs> you can fix this stuff yourself pretty easy and you might even be able to turn a profit by doing the repairs yourself and selling it online a lot of people like to collect this stuff so again the run capacitor right there uh, if your motor is coming on and everything seems okay it might not be that but more than likely it's it will start the motor up when they start to get weak it'll still run the motor but it'll be really weak <clears throat> it'll seem like the motor's bad but usually like i said it's just this um also there's the fuses if you want to check those old style fuses. You can still find them at some auto parts stores, etc. But um, the sizes aren't always real obvious. But if you just take one in and, and look on the shelf at the ones they have there, you can find a pretty good example of something pretty close. Pretty close. Anyway, guys, if you have any questions, leave them in the comments. And uh, if you like the video, please like and subscribe for all sorts of weird stuff that I do with trucks, cars, uh, side by sides, motorcycles. I'll have a lot more videos coming. So again, thanks for watching. Take care.